Hello students, welcome to Srinis Math. This video we are going to discuss about the questions from GATE 2023 block diagram reduction topic. In the following block diagram, R of S and D of S are two inputs. The output Y of S is expressed as Y of S is equal to G1 R plus G2 D. And G1 of S and G2 of S are given by here. So for options given, we need to pick which one. From the diagram, there is a two input and one output. So the same types of question in a semester exam point of view means uh, we, we can use a superposition theorem to find the final result. For example, uh, the first one, we assume T of S is equal to zero. We can able to find Y of S divided by R of S. The next R of S is equal to zero means we can able to find y of s divided by G d of s. Then we combine like. But in a gate or any other competitive exam purpose not required the corresponding steps. And also now use uh, instead of y of s we fix only y and d of s means just like. So from the diagram we move the reverse process and this position is y and the same y is here also. Then after multiply y and h then this position is h into y here there is no block so this position is y from the first summing point the output is, is equal to r is input that is positive so r and here it's a negative sign so minus y and the next summing point the output is equal to d is positive and this one is also positive so r minus y directly and the bottom one h y it's a minus sign so minus h into y then after this position that means after g so it just multiplied by g of s also so the final result y is as equal to g times of d plus r minus y minus h y then we multiply individually so y is as equal to g d plus g r minus g y minus g h then y then just moving the y terms in a single side so y plus g y plus g h then y is equal to g into d plus g into r then you just take a y outside so y is moving out 1 plus g plus g h is equal to g d plus g r then we need a y and this one is moving to another side there is a division y is as equal to g d plus g r divided by 1 plus g plus g h then the actual question y of s is equal to g1 of s r of s plus g2 of s d of s so just compare y of s is is equal to g1 of s into r of s plus g2 of s into d of s now we move individual terms so y is as equal to g d divided by 1 plus g plus g h then g r divided by 1 plus g plus g h now compare for both and instead of g2 the place value is this one the place value of g1 is equal to this one 
so for both g1 and g2 same so g1 of s is is equal to g2 of s is is equal to g of s divided by 1 plus g of s plus g of s into h of s is the actual meaning so from the option a is the answer. Thank you.